The CBC's Hannah Thibodeau joins us live from Ottawa. Hannah, can you tell us more about the ruling? Sure. There was reaction, actually, on the steps of the Supreme Court. Supporters of this unanimous ruling were there, and they were smoking pot. Uh, it was a unanimous decision by the Supreme Court justices, as you mentioned. And what they say is they ruled people who need medical marijuana uh, should be allowed to use cannabis, not only in the dry form and smoking it, but also in oils, cookies, lip balms, those types of things. Now, the lower courts ruled that it deprived users of their right to take their medicine in the form that they chose. And the Supreme Court of Canada did agree with this. So many people didn't want to have to smoke it. And the reason for that is they felt it was potentially harmful. Now, users and advocates, as I mentioned, were on the steps of the Supreme Court celebrating their win today. And here's what one of them had to say. So with having an extract that is simply that, I'm able to ingest it and get the same sort of uh, medicinally beneficial effects that I would as compared to smoking, but not having to smoke it. So it's nice to, to know that I'm not a criminal for using my medicine the way that I need to. So what's the government saying about this, Hannah? Uh, government is not happy with this decision. Now, let me go through how it all came about. In 2009, there was a man named Owen Smith, and he was found to have 200 pot cookies and some cannabis oils in his apartment in Victoria. He was arrested, and he was charged with trafficking. His lawyer said, though, hold on a second, that's not constitutional, that you can't use this in other forms, and you can't give it to people who need this in other forms. Well, of course, today, the highest court in the land agreed with them, but the appeal was by the government because they felt that uh, they shouldn't be able to do this. It wasn't safe. And also, uh, once you call it medicine, then you normalize it. Take a listen to what Health Minister Ron Ambrose has to say. And now today, the Supreme Court has ruled that, that marijuana cookies and brownies are quote unquote medicinal treatment. Let's remember, there's only one authority in Canada that can create, the, that has the authority and the expertise to make a drug into a medicine, and that's Health Canada. So she went on to say that she was outraged with the ruling by the Supreme Court justices. She said she'll continue to fight this, but how will they fight this? Because the final word was by the Supreme Court of Canada. There are no more courts for the government to go to. So what she said is she's going to fight this through messaging to tell people that pot is not healthy. Uh, so that was one of the things she said, and she said they're going to target that messaging at young people.